Twitch. And we have a nice loading screen. We do. Alright, green team for this game. Gonna be Rain. One's reversed. And they're gonna be running Montana, Vermont, Brisbane, Moscow, Gearing, Daring, Clever, Clever, Ragnar. That is like all of the DDs. Like all of them. Yes. At the same time. Um, Jay Z is running Ohio, Schlieffen, Salem, Stalingrad, Venezia, Napoli, Kleber, Yuyang, and Wagner. So, Jay Z again going for the Venezia pick, and they're bringing a Schlieffen as well. That's a spicy one. Hmm. Right, so, um, yes, Schlieffen and Venezia. Alright, let's have a look at some builds. Alright, so Rain, Nearing, Basti, gonna be running Dazzle and Legmod and yeah, whatever. Uh, it's Clever. a heavy AP Vermont! Yes! We haven't got to that yet. Yes! Yep, that's that's Dastard with the heavy AP Vermont. He's been taking a page out of Henning's book. We have Montana, wearing style, relatively standard stuff. We have relatively standard stuff, but yes. Uh, Dazzle on the gearing, that's about all that's spectacularly weird. Alright, red team. Nine. Wait, is he running exactly my build? I think he is. Wow. And once again, we see the return of the range mod Venezia. The binoculars. Um, Schlieffen going to be running full secondary FHE. No demolition expert, though. Napoli going to be running outnumbered and top grade gunner and Damacon mod, Damacon mod and slot one. Salem here, real mod, RPF. Ragnar with RPF. Yeah, at least he's not running peepers anymore. Or binoculars. Alright, anyway, let's look at some initial deployments. Where's everybody going? Green team is going over at the air cap and they're going to be sending Kleber, Ragnar, getting Brisbane and Vermont in support between A and B. The daring is going to go directly to B. Do not pass go to not collect 200 pounds. Moscow's going to be up behind him. And over at C, we're going to be going with Kleber. Maybe looking for a fast cap, but he's going to be opposed by the opposing Kleber and a Montana. I think where the red's going. The red team is sending Yu Young Venetia towards the A cap in Ohio, pretty far behind. Salem Wagner on the B cap, but the Salem taking the Spice Island on B. Um, Kleber just running towards the nine line as fast as possible with Napoli, Schlieffen, and Stalin guard behind it. Although the Stalin looks like it's just going towards the seven line small island. Well, Stalingrad's already popped his radar to try and find the opposing Kleber of sheep. He isn't going to find it, but uh, the Kleber, the Kleber of Darling is probably going to find him. Yeah, uh, Stalingrad radar will pick him up right at the end there. Yep, he's had spotted now. Sheep reverses. No, that was the radar still. Oh no, he's not. Yeah, he's running Legendary Kleber. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dodges the salvo, right. takes the cap, gets away with that. And as we see, the opposing Kleber is actually like also running leg mod, but he's running Damacon one slot one. I, I don't know, man. I don't know either, mate. Like that, that one is just weird. Yeah, B cap, daring, caught in a Ragnar radar. It's out of it. Doesn't really take that much damage. Still a couple more salvos coming in. There's some more salvos coming in. It's fine. And A was also flipped. Now. So Rain have yeah, two early... cap lead already. Yeah, early caps for Rain. And again, this Yuyang Venezia combination, I'm not sure what it's trying to achieve here. Like, they're just gonna get pushed away. Like, really, really hard. Or, or, alternatively, they can eat torpedoes. They didn't, but they could. Uh, Brisbane Rail comes out, does catch the Yu Yang. Yep. Lulu takes a little bit of a chunk from the Venezia, but the Venezia took a much bigger chunk in return. Long range yes, shots coming in from Ohio. Now, but, yeah, no, yeah, just not close. Brisbane just accelerates away. Yeah. Uh, so Yu Yang takes, like, you know, a little bit of damage from all that. 7,000. Yeah, he's still taking hits, actually. Can I just say that I like... It, like, this is the reason why I don't like Ohio as a kiting ship. So you don't the shell velocity is so slow that everything can just accelerate away from you. Like, it's so unlikely for you to actually connect your shells because, like... It basically, you have one second more shell travel time at, like, medium range over all other battleships you could take. And I hate that so much. 
Like, yes, you're incredibly tanky. But you're also, like, sometimes you're, you're just not threatening enough, I feel like. Well, there's nothing more threatening than a kiting battleship and spawn in full HP, Henning. I don't know what you're talking about. Alright, so, uh, Jay-Z are gonna finally be able to rotate on the sea cap. They're, like, you know, range is one of the early points, and now they've got a kiting clever Montana force. Gonna be not very fun to push into, because that is a leg mod clever, gonna be doing the spots, and that's gonna be, like, tops and everything else, and that's gonna completely counter the opposing leg mod trying to push in, because he's gonna just have a Montana in his face if he tries to, so, yeah. Well, Jay-Z is gonna have Flipsy, you know, so that's good for them. That's gonna equalize the income... So yeah, the point but... difference of 200 points right now is not going to increase any further. Angle out towards the sailing position is not going to connect. He's uh, sitting there hiding behind his rock. He's quite happy with that. There's a big swell of DDs above the B cap, by the way. Like There is. I mean, Wayne actually just relocated all their forces from AOA. Like, they're just comfortable playing with Gearing Wisman against uh, Jay Jay-Z's forces here. And I honestly can understand this. Like, what what is Jay-Z gonna do here? Push back with a Vader, you young? Into a Wisman? Like, mm. how is that gonna work? It's not. Yeah, but so far, Wayne just shuffling around ships a little bit. Um, Jay-Z is honestly the only thing I'm seeing mo see moving from Jay-Z right now is the clip air going towards the B-cap. I don't think he's gonna do anything there though. In fact, he might just get himself killed here if he tries to commit too hard immediately. There's a Daring, there's a Vermont, there's a Wagner and a Moskva all just posting up over the B-cap. Yeah, they're just, it's just currently penning them in. Like, they, like Rain don't need to do anything right now. They have, as any like to say, win con. Well, the Klebea's going for it. He's going for the bow in contest, so he can just turn left yeah. one away, anyways. And he's spot. And now Raiders come out. Both the Moskva and the Stalingrad are waitering. And. Lots of things are spotted. Yes. I mean, honestly, there's not going to be that much damage training back and forth here. Like, everyone's, like, max range. Maybe the daring takes a little bit of a chunk, but honestly, it's... He seems to be fine as well. Stalingrad has a torpedo issue. Again. Yeah, Stalingrad it takes two clever clubs. I took two, I think. I think one of them got eaten by the island. Nah, he was just getting chunked by everything else falling at the same time. That Stalingrad's low and could potentially go down here. Like, I mean, he's down damage gun now, so every fire... On him, we'll just be a perma now. He has yeah. some silver from sheep coming in. But no fires. He Apart is Apart from that one there. Alive. No, he's still flooding that's... actually. Yeah, yeah, that's an engine end cap. Engine in cap plus flooding. This is this is a lot of HP lost. Oh, that's a fire, Henning. Me... That's that's a fire. Is that? Yes. Fire that's definitely a fire. Zoom in on it. It's not coming from the smokestack. It was a superstructure on fire. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Anyway, uh, yeah. So... They're trying to contest B again. Daring reverses to get the SWAT. Wagner just pops his radar and this is gonna hurt. Uh, Vermont killed the Stalingrad. Yeah. Missed that, but he was so low. The Vermont just found an angle over like several islands there, actually. Just, just a funny little angle right there. And meanwhile, on A, the Yu Yang decides to, like, you know what, I'm gonna try to contest A, and he lost, like, all his health. Mm hmm. Got caught on that Brisbane radar for quite a while. He is actually sticking the cat now, but uh, you can just run at him. Is he leg mode, Yu Yang? He's not. He's. 
Oh, is that well, a leg mod that's gearing though? Le leg mod Yu Yang would be terrible. Yeah. Well, he does radar the gearing. There will be a Venezia salvo coming. Nope, never mind. The Venezia's already shot the Brisbane. So, I don't know what to tell you, Chief. Yes, you know where the gearing is, but nobody can shoot him. Maybe the Ohio cool. can, but I think the Ohio is aiming towards B. Any Maybe the Ohio is actually looking at him. Well, Yu Yang has like seven seconds of radar left. The Venezia salvo comes in now. There's literally nothing because the gearing was turned into him, and yeah. And now the gearing can bully the Yu Yang out the cap. And probably even kill it. There's also a counter push of rain happening on the 910 line, by the way. The Schlieff is just dead. Yeah. I kind of missed that completely. But then she just got caught in a turn. and chunked by the Montana and just. Just in general, just dies. Yep, he just goes down, and now the Napoli is in a very, very, very bad spot. Yeah. Uh, meanwhile, trading back and forth at B once again. Uh, Brisbane dies? Brisbane actually yeah. dies in the one line. That's yeah. a good kill. Didn't respect the Ohio enough. But that's a good one. Uh, well, the Ragnar just took a top, so... Oh, no. Speaking of things about to take tops, this Napoli's about to have all of the fun, isn't he? Is he fast enough to outrun these? Looks like the bear tops, they're incredibly fast. The answer is, uh, a oh, resounding, no. uh... No, no, he is not fast enough to outrun those. Not even remotely. He's also flooding. He's also on fire. He's also suffering. He's also taking an Ohio south of the bow. He's also dead. That was not an Ohio, that was a Montana, but yes. Point stands. We're not even talking about the fact that there's a Montana in my game. Keep up with the matter, Henning. So out like, of why touch. Why is there Montana? And why is it like 910 left? <laughs> well, the bear of Jay-Z gets spotted again on B, trying to contest. Uh, just gets spotted by the daring dipping in very shortly. Raider is coming out from the uh, from the Ragnar trying to get additional damage in, but it's just not enough. And Hexogen still has his Raider already, by the way. He could just pop it right now and he would catch the Clipper and probably kill him. Yeah. And the Clipper is going to touch the cap in like a few seconds. Well, there it is. There's, There's the Raider. Can the Clay Bear live? The tops are actually really nice. Well, Clay Bear gets oh. out unscathed. How's the Ragnar looking about these tops? Oh, he's fine as well. He's fine as well. So, off of that Brisbane kill, Jay Z actually managed to counter push A now, and they flipped that one. So, that's really, really good. However, they're gonna lose C uh, in turn, which, you know. Well, right now, they hold all of the caps. Oh, well, they hold two of the caps. They do, but they're also, like, so far behind on points that they have to, like, keep it that way, and they can't. They're gonna lose C here. They're trying to cap B... With a Salem in front forward, of Bastet. But... That's... that's I assume like... Dastat just shoots him in the face, right? Uh, oh, look! Dastat yeah, is shooting him in the face. It's only, like... Back to us right now. I mean, yes, but like, I think that's enough, honestly. Yep, he also has a like angry clip bear on his side. It was actually just chilling because he doesn't need to go. He's just proxy spotting the Salem right now for the Ramon to shoot him. Montana claps the de uh, the Ragnar. Oh, Salem yeah, gets clapped by Dastat, and that yeah. was just a bastard. Okay, yeah, that's just. It's just over now. I mean, it's been over for a while, really. Uh, Jay-Z tried to do something, but yeah. There is no real opportunities to be had. <laughs> now there's a full HP Ohio that's just getting... He's full HP! Directions. He's running his first year now. 
He's about to do what we call burst tanking. Well, first it's gonna be our friend is gonna die. Yes. So, um... EU server clash against, you know, the world is going quite well today, apparently. Uh, it is. It, it actually is. I mean, you know, it's Wayne. It's the EU's number two seed. They're very strong. I mean, you know Wayne. Yeah. Everyone knows Wayne. If you don't know Wayne, and I don't know what you're doing. Well, the gang just got slapped. Well, he is just, you know, white next to an Ohio. Yeah. And should open water gun boating it. I mean, yeah, at this point, why not? There's like, you know, zero seconds left on the clock. Gotta pad that average damage here. Well, so this Ohio burst tanking worked really well, don't you think? Yeah, he survived! Right, well, Rain gonna take that game 1-0. Uh, there is, like, you know, still map 2 to play, but yes. Yep. Very convincing win. Honestly, the only thing that went went wrong for Wayne was the Brisbane dying on the one line. Everything else was really controlled, honestly. Alright, but as you said, we have a map too, and it's Land of Fire. Which yes. we haven't seen today, right? We haven't. I haven't had a chance to make fun of you. Because <laughs> that's how you remember those things. It is. Swift and Silence, Ten Line, Kremlin, Land of Fire. Except it's called Brisk oh. now. All right. Um, anyway, what's the bands? Have... Give me the bands. Give we me the bands. A... We have a slightly different band for Jay-Z. They're banning Schlieven now. And right. Wayne just stayed on the Massey band. Okay. So, yeah. Let me go, uh, tell you what. I'm gonna press the button. That's gonna give you like, like a long introduction about what the next map is, and then you're gonna be like, "Wow, I haven't seen this video before." And then I'm gonna be, yeah. Alright, then let's go. Shores of the North Sea are the setting for a titanic clash of enemy fleets. That was North. <laughs> Shut up. At the extreme southern tip of South America lies an archipelago rich in history and diversity. Soon these storied waters will play host to a heroic clash between opposing forces and the region will live up to its name. This is Land of Fire. Land of Fire is a 48 by 48 kilometer domination style map with three cap points running in a line from west to east. The A cap is on the left, B is in the center and C is on the right. To the west, the island in the center of capture area A makes it a challenging cap to acquire early. Teams commonly park a radar cruiser in the cap to push away enemy destroyers while preventing the other team from capturing the zone. Cap B in the center is wide open with plenty of ways in and out and is initially the purview of competing destroyers. If combat shifts to an east-west axis, it's common to see some spectacular mid and late game pushes through the center of the map. On the right, Cap C and the islands to the east make it a tempting target for teams looking for early cap points. But the teams who invest too much firepower along this edge of the map may find themselves at an extreme disadvantage later in the game. 18 ships, two teams, one victor. It's time to play Land of Fire. Sit here and wait until they like, start talking again. Well, that might be a while, considering we've just been kicked out of the training room. Uh, any reasons, or it's just, you know... I don't know. Was it Lemon Eagle? I can't remember. No.
Now he has like other streamer organization drama going on already, so you know. Oh really? Yes. Where? Apparently, like a referee didn't bother to like rename the match that he was hosting, so like some streamers missed their game. Right. You know how it's all listed on like the website. I mean, hmm. I mean, like, basically, um, the referee was hosting, uh, what was it? Uh, do, 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 do. What ho uh, was hosting Penta versus TSYMQ, but the room said it was Sharp versus Elsa. Who's, so our, who's, our, who's our host? That's the most important question. Still the same person. Which is. Dominus Potatoes. Okay, cool. That's what I asked you, is what is his name? Not, is it the same person? <laughs> <laughs> look. Why are you looking for the referee? I just look for, you know, I just, I just type in ref, and then I look through the rooms that are popping up, and look for the one where there's Wayne Tag in there. And that's exactly how I was just saying that, like, one streamer missed his game because he did exactly that. It's fine. Oh, we have some copy pasta here. Let me let me see what's this. RDDs are inherently overpowered. Isn't that one like really old? Ragnar is inherently underpowered. I mean, this one is, DDs are inherently overpowered, the most overpowered class in the game. Undetectable if they never want to be spotted, they never will be spotted. Torps are just devastate and one shot everything they touch. Super high DPM guns, heals, death AA, speed boost, smoke. Can make all the mistakes at once. Such a forgiving class of ships that even the newest of players can get in and control games. Has zero counters in game. Vex subs, CAs, CLs, BBs, and Shred CV planes. Nerf ED, please, Wiki. <laughs> Damn, HG. Okay. Yeah, that's. Yeah. Okay. No. Especially the last part was just too much of a stretch, sorry. No one can take you seriously if, if you say that you know you Shred CV planes. Because no, nothing does. What are you squinting at? Discord. What are you looking for? Nothing, I'm reading drama. Oh, I I, I want in. No. I think chat wants as well. No. Do you mean no? No. <laughs> Is it drama that can't, it's not open for public discussion? Yes. Why though? Because I'm on secret servers that you're not. That's 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 sad. Yeah, that's no. drama. It's spicy. You can't just, you know, can't just tell me there's drama and not tell me what it is. I can. I can tell you what it is later. <laughs> I'll tell everyone else. Wow. Professionalism. Professionalism. I, th I thought we, I thought we weren't professionals. I think you guys still frozen. <laughs> <laughs> what is frozen? You guys still? <laughs> no, yours not. No, I, I was I was staying perfectly still. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Why are you even no mentioning that? Like you know, if you if you like summon it into existence, it's not my fault. I I literally can see you still moving. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Professional caster, by the way. Yup. Our people can't get in. Uh, okay, but they're all in the room. Do you want to do me a favor, Henning? Uh, which one? Do you want to go check that for tomorrow's game, is that we've done the same thing where we cast the same person or, like, the people... <laughs> the same individual over and over. I mean, we could go for, like, the same referee every time. Uh, that's also an option, but that sounds like effort. Uh, let me have a look. Our first game tomorrow is going to be Wayne versus Elsa. <sighs> Followed by Wayne versus Shaft. Followed by... Oh no, then you have Boar Panther, which... Yeah, yeah, okay, I want to see that as well. Yeah. I mean, all of the final games tomorrow look really good. Like, all of them. I mean, today is the day where, like, all the top seeds play against all the lower seeds, and tomorrow is the day where, like, you know... Top seeds play each other. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, training room's kind of fucked. Uh, that is possible. Yeah, I'm in the spectators. A. What is this? Penta dropped the map. To who? To Tsuki. All right. That's the first map they lost the Scots. Oh no, we have a potential for a three-way tie because of that. Oh no. Well, let's see Panda. how much uh, map 2 goes. Panda versus Suki. Pia versus Suki. Huh. I know. Hang on, I'm being pinged. Oh, for fuck's sake. Look at training room chat. Please ready up. We'll wait official EN chat. Nice. I'm looking at the vendor and apparently like so he just pushed and Peter just died to that. Okay. That happens. It's fine. All the teams are ready, so surely we're gonna look. Uh, surely we're gonna like you know. Start soon, ish. Yeah, don't worry. Our, our next game is saying that they may have delays, but luckily we have one of the teams that is going to be delayed anyway, so they have to wait for us. Yes, exactly. It's great. Mm. Mm. Waiting for a CN caster. Or EN. I don't even fucking know. I can't yeah. read. That's also a thing. Tomorrow, like, our last set is not going to be containing... 
uh, containing one of the teams we cast in the set before. But you know, it will contain right. official. <laughs> it will contain official, so we're gonna be on time anyways. Well, you see that. Well, right, anyway, land of fire. Have a map introduction video. I don't care that I've already shown you it. Have it again. At the extreme southern tip of South America lies an archipelago rich in history and diversity. So Never mind, we're starting. <laughs> yep, we lied. <laughs> Actually, pains are lied. I didn't I lie. Right, green team for this game. We're gonna make sure I've got the teams. I've got them wrong way around again. Right, anyway, green team for this game. It's gonna be oh, rain, and they're gonna be running Ohio, Burgoyne, Brisbane, Des Moines, Napoli, Gearing. Why am I talking like this? Claire, Claire, Ragno. And Jay Z is running Ohio, Kremlin, Des Moines, Stalingrad, Napoli, Shimakaze, Hanogumo, Daring, and Claire. So, green team pool one picks is going to be the Brisbane and Ragnar. And then Natalie from... No, well, Natalie from pool one, Brisbane, Ragnar, pool two. Meanwhile, Napoli from pool one and Kremlin, Stalingrad from pool two. Yep. So, let's take a look at some... Yeah, I don't mind it. You run it down the town line of Land of Fire. Anyway... Well, you say that, but he's trying towards the one line, so I joked on you. Oh, well, they're using the ablative armor, armor technique, or she also using that. So. Anyway, yes. Uh, gearing, leg mod, dazzle. Um, Burgoyne for rain this time, not for the other team. Um, Napoli running Peepa's mod. Binoculus. Uh, yeah. All right, Haragumo going to be running Binoculus Mod, BFT, Swift and Silence, and Not Superintendent. We also have Dazzle, Daring, and Dazzle, Shima. Yes, we have Dazzle, Shima, we have Binoculus, Stalingrad, we have Dazzle, Daring, we have Smoke Mod, Daring, we have Des Moines, Leg Mod, sorry, Billy Expert, which is fine. We have Leg Mod, Kleber, uh, Napoli with Reload Mod, and we have... A tank build Ohio with slot one Damacon. So can right. you like tell me about the deployment Wayne is doing here because my lord. Yeah, so over at the A cap we're gonna be sending Kleber, Kleber, Brisbane, but going to mine gearing over at the B cap island, Ohio going to be straight ahead next B and then a Ragnar there. And then over at C cap we're gonna be sending a Napoli and did nothing. I assume the Ragnar will rotate off B to help go contest C soon, but yes. I don't think so. He's gonna be stuck uh, stuck in contesting B for a while, I'm pretty sure. Unless the gearing is gonna rotate over and take this job from him. Maybe. Anyways, um, Jay Z is running Haragumo and Shimmer towards the A cap with a daring behind on the four line. Kremlin going the long way around towards A as well. Stalingrad sitting on the four five line island in the back with the Moin taking the five line F six line more aggressively to south of B. Clippy are going for the fast contest on C, and Napoli, Ohio are gonna go there to con uh, to assist him as well. Stalingrad Radar came out, picked up the Ragnar, forced him out of the cap, but nothing much more gonna come of it. We're also finding the gearing, and he's gonna find the Des Moines maybe with like the last second, but that's the one to see. Oh, there's the Des Moines Raider though. He definitely catches the Des Moines. Clebas have found the Haragumo and Shimakaze. Uh, this might be a dead Haragumo, honestly. Nice, smoking up. There needs to be a lot of blind fire for him to die. And... I get spotted again. He's suffering. His engine's out. He is. That's a permafire as well. He spotted again. Yeah, he's caught in a the Brisbane radar. He's dead. Like, he's, he's just dead. Yeah, now he is just dead. Shimmer's caught, and, too. Yeah, radar's gonna end soon, though, so... He's probably gonna live this. Yeah, he's... I mean, he he's took a battering. He's fine, but... <laughs> that, is an, that is an opening and a half here. Two Clebers just diving down the one line, getting a free kill, and just leaving. They only lost 10k HP on one of the Clebers. That's not a lot, all things considered. 
So the Ragnar did not, in fact, rotate off the B cap just yet. Um... Yeah, he's just contesting. He's getting blind fire now. That was a good hit. He doesn't have Raider ready, but has, the Des Moines still does. So Jay Z's daring can't really contest himself. Another blind fire coming up from the starting guard. Wagner is now spotted. He knows it's the daring, but he is still just waiting for the daring to actually touch the cap before he's like poke, asking his Des Moines to Raider, and then he's gonna poke out and shoot him. If he wants to do that. The daring is just. Right. Yeeting a few conga lines towards the Ragnar's position. Makes sense. Lulu is spotted by a Shrimkazi right now. Doesn't have his radar ready. Morning radar comes out, Stalingrad radar comes out. Cross little little Venn diagram of death going on at the B cap here. Yep. Then I'm just gonna get reset here. Question is, are these drops like dangerous at all? I don't think they are. Yep. Wagner has ducks behind the island and is fine. Daring took a little bit of damage, but also not too much. Vader is still active for a few seconds though. Oh, never mind, just went down. Uh, look at the sea cap though. Jay Z's Claire is going on an adventure. Yeah, and that's a leg mod Claver, and you don't really want a leg mod Claver in your back lines because he can free top things. He can actually These tops top. on the Wagner are interesting. Like, I'm not sure if this Wagner expects the seven line tops here. I don't think anyone expects the seven line tops. But they're not going to hit, so. Well, you sure? Well. Ah, uh, yeah, he's fine. Okay, and it actually gives them a lot of info as well. They now know that the Clippers there. In fact, Wayne's Napoli on the ten line now. You know, yeah, he's kind of running out of map. I mean, you can always just turn around and go trade the opposing Napoli. It's still break. pretty difficult with a with a Lagmont Clippers next to you. Alright, yeah, radar comes out, Red Des Moines, B cap, spots the Ragnar, spots the Gearing, spots the Des Moines, spots Kleber. The Ragnar actually sees the Ohio now as well, and that's not something you want to see. They're yeah. just gonna stink. Lulu used his Brisbane radar, spotted the Shemkazi and Kremlin, they know where those oh. are. Kremlin Salvo goes across to the Des Moines as well, I think you might get a decent chunk here. Apparently it didn't stink because the Ohio just missed. And so did the Kremlin, so. Alright, what's happening over here? Napoli, a real ship shady. Is, uh. I don't know if he expects the Clipper to be there. He is slowing down right now, so he's probably gonna, like, see these tops. Maybe eat one. And then he knows the Clipper is, like, on his side. He's gonna eat one here, but that's not the end of the world. Yeah, smoke ready, so we can do the f oof. That one hard. Yeah, he's doing his little smoke turn now, so we'll go check out what's happening with the rest of the map. Because B Cap has once again a big brawl breaking out, daring getting like locked down on the radar in front of an entire firing squad. Yeah, Darren yep. not enjoying that one very much at all, really, is he? Yep. That's the power of Kleber. Just, you know, you can just rotate them around. And if you don't expect the rotation and get caught like this, then you're suffering. And this is a power fire on the Daring as well. He has one heal remaining, but it's not gonna get him to like a lot of HP. It's like gonna be six, seven K. He's gonna limp away. Right, what's happening he, with this 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 Napoli now? The smoke screen's about to end. He's done a, f oh, he's done a Henning rotation. He's done a full three sixty. Look, 
He's trying his best to waste as much time as possible. Yeah, and he's gonna succeed. I mean, the corner of the map's right here. He's gonna just delay this as long as possible. He's dead, so there's no point watching him. I don't think yeah. he's gonna be able to trade anything either, so... Yeah, he's Double. gonna die here eventually. The question is just how much longer it's gonna take these two. Okay, so Kremlin's making the jump over here, question mark? At ACAP? Uh, he's he just... ass in, so no. Oh. He's just he's just looking for uh for that Des Moines at some point. Or the Brisbane. But now we have Malamu coming around the corner. That shimmer is so deep in that Brisbane radar, by the way. So deep. We are Shady is gonna die now. She can't dodge these stops. Like, if, if Lulu, Lulu, Lulu crosses his radar... Yeah, it is. There it is. Yeah, he does find the Shimmer, but... Shimmer is already angling out, so I'm not sure if he is actually going to take too much here. The Kremlin, in the meantime, taking tops. Like, two tops here, and the Brisbane tops look good as well. Look at that Dazzle coming in clutch right now. Look at all these shells yeah, missing. The Kremlin just straight up dies. Look, look, look at the Dazzle gaming we've got going on here. Yes. All right, back I to Bika. Didn't see any difference. Yeah. But so the Bika is still really explosive, and Wayne's problem is that they did lose like the C flank completely now. So while they are ahead one ship and they are ahead in points, holding this advantage could become difficult in a long one. I mean, at the same time, they if, fully control the air cap. In fact, no, if they send Gang right now into sea, they just take that for free. There's, like, they, they've overextended past that. Like, you've opened up a massive gap in your defensive line where you could just walk into that cap right now. Daring is also spotted again at 5k HP. That's all he has. Uh, Brisbane torpedo the Shimakazi. Oh, Look at me! No. I am the torpedo boat now! Oh. Oh. That's unfortunate. That is really unfortunate. That's... yeah. I think that just seals the deal. Because now Wayne can just do the same on A that Jay-Z did on C. Just walk through, get on into Jay-Z's flank. And honestly, Jay-Z doesn't have any forces to like prevent that push, while... Wayne already has positioned themselves in a way that Jay-Z can't really capitalize on their position. Now look at the health deficit right now. It's like, a lot. It's, it's not that much considering you're up two ships. I mean, it is. It's like 100,000. It's like... However, the firing squad has arrived and has found a starting guard. Yeah, he's um doing what we like to call suffering right now. Yeah, this is like this is you know the reason why massive and uh, mass black mass aren't a thing anymore. Like just because you know they're limited. Mm. Well, Sangrad um, now on double fire. Um... That is a fire, Henning. That is a fire. That's not his engine, that's a fire. Yeah, he had fun. Uh, they might also be getting the Des Moines here as well. There's like a big Burgoyne cross shots coming in. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think that Des Moines is kind of like a little bit, um, a little bit, shall we say, uh, suffering. I mean, the Clemens is running through them, just basically inting for the kill now. Gearing killed the Des Moines? Question mark? Look. Sometimes you just want to have a kill as well, okay? Yeah, yeah, it's understandable. Gotta pad that uh, PR. The, 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 wow's numbers, uh, cots data are gonna be uh, looking spicy with that. No, the daring is gonna hide with the clipper in a second. Oh no! Anyway! <laughs> and there's a Bisman Raider, and daring is spotted. Yeah. Uh, 
right, so, um... Yeah, this might be over. Do you think so? What makes you think no. that? No, he's, look, between them, they still have 96,000 health. That's like a battleship. Yes. So clearly they can win the game versus seven ships. And a uh, 500 point deficit? <laughs> yeah. I don't think so, Chief. Well, maybe the Ohio does devastate the mine here. That would be, you know, helpful. Oh, he has to get a no. decent chunk, but that's not enough. Napoli found the clever. Well, the clever found the Napoli. I'm not sure which. Uh... You may not like it, but this is what peak Napoli performance looks like. Secondaries blaring on two DDs at the same time. Maybe the Elias is going to die in the events of the game. But I want to see the clever kill the Napoli. Aww. Yep. Not happening. Uh, Unfortunate. Well, Rain will take that to a zero. Looking good for the EU teams, I must say. Yep. My chat saying things like Dazzle Wolf. Help me. <laughs> Are they wrong though? Are they wrong? Was it worth? I mean, apparently it doesn't help against top the uh, top dispersion, so you know. Henning, did you just like secretly sneak into my channel and subscribe when I wasn't paying attention? Yes. Understandable. Have a nice day.